Hi, it's Alicia. I'm here filming a quick video. It's Christmas Day, about 10 p.m. Um, Christmas Day 2020. Um, I've always wanted to film, just get little bits and pieces of what Christmas is like in Australia. I know um, friends and family of mine living overseas in America, Canada, and elsewhere in Europe. Um, would be wondering what Christmas in Australia looks like considering that we have Christmas in summer and this sounds completely absurd to them it sounds weird to have Christmas in summer it's a completely strange concept and um, what's funny is that they're wishing for snow and they're dreaming of a white Christmas meanwhile us Aussies, we are dreaming of a warm and sunny Christmas day. So I've filmed bits and pieces of what Christmas day was like this year. So I'm going to start off talking about what we do on Christmas Eve. So I go to my grandma's place for dinner and on TV there's always the Carols by Candlelight and it's filmed in Melbourne at the Maya Music Bowl. And all the carols are sung and they have all, you know, Australian singers and celebrities um, performing them with the big um, Australian choirs and all that and a massive orchestra. And it's a really um, must-see event. Everybody's watching this um, on Christmas Eve. This year was a bit different. You didn't see the massive choir in the background and they had everyone on Zoom on the background. It was kind of funny to watch. But there's this one particular song um, that I always have to watch. I can't miss it. It's the Hallelujah Chorus and they do an absolutely spectacular job at it every year. And the conductor of the orchestra, his name is John Foreman and he's my absolute like favourite. I almost just I always watch the Carols by Candlelight just to sort of see him. And um, in this song, uh, John Foreman has the big symbols and he has to uh, clash the symbols perfectly on the last note. <laughs> So that's always a highlight for me. On Christmas Eve, we also open our presents, which is always a fun time. So Christmas Day. Today was 19 degrees Celsius, and we would have preferred it to be a little bit warmer, but it was still a, a really nice day. The sun was out shining, a um, little bit chilly sometimes, but yeah, it's, it's funny. Like we genuinely, like we want Christmas day. We hope for Christmas day to be like a really sunny day, a really warm, sunny day. The roads are pretty quiet this year. I'm assuming people are more wanting to stay at home because of COVID. I'll insert some clips of how it was today and um, the food that we ate and um, just how the weather was and all that, so enjoy!
So there you have it. There's a bit of a glimpse into Christmas in Australia. It's kind of like I welcomed you to my side of the world, um, into my hemisphere. <laughs> um, kind of crazy how far Australia is from all the other countries and all my friends and family who are overseas. Um, that thought of like welcoming into a f welcoming somebody into your land that's foreign to them reminds me of how Jesus came to the earth. He was, he came to our world. He was welcomed into our world, and that reminds me of this beautiful, um, beautiful song called "Welcome to Our World." I'll put the lyrics in the description. Um, but yeah, um, I know we have all different traditions at Christmas time and celebrate in different ways, but we have to let that not detract from the true meaning of Christmas and that um, our hearts should be very merry because of Jesus. Because Jesus came to our world, the Creator became the creation to save us. And I just think um, that song really embodies that. The, I think the first verse goes, Hope that you don't mind our manger, how we wish we would have known. But long awaited, holy stranger, make yourself at home. And then another verse um, really captures that idea that he was destined to die even when he was born. It says, um, fragile fingers that were sent to heal us, tender brow prepared for thorns, tiny heart whose blood would save us unto us is born. So I just really wanted to um, share that with you. I wish you all a very happy and safe Christmas. Um, pray that the Lord will um, bless you and be with you at this time and that you would find true peace in the Lord Jesus Christ. And um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna play a few chords. I'm still learning. It's hard. So thanks for watching.